Have you ever wondered what it would be like to travel back in time? It's an idea that has captured the imagination of countless thinkers, writers and dreamers throughout history. The concept of time travel, the ability to journey into the past or future, has been a cornerstone of science fiction for centuries. It's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? Being able to witness events that have long passed or to gaze upon the mysteries of the future. Yet, with such an extraordinary concept, comes a multitude of theories and paradoxes. These are the puzzles that have both intrigued and baffled the greatest minds. They arise from the complex nature of time itself and the implications of being able to manipulate it. Concepts like causality, the butterfly effect, and the multiverse theory are some of the many fascinating aspects that surround the idea of time travel. One of the most famous paradoxes is the grandfather paradox. But what exactly is it? Imagine for a moment you had a time machine. Now let's venture into the realm of the grandfather paradox, a classic time travel conundrum that has puzzled scientists and sci-fi enthusiasts alike for decades. Picture this. You decide to take a trip back in time and for some inexplicable reason, you end up causing the death of your own grandfather before your parent was even conceived. This action, while drastic, brings us to a fascinating paradox. If your grandfather died before your parent was conceived then your parent would never be born, and if your parent was never born, you in turn, would never exist. But here's where things get tricky. If you never existed how could you have traveled back in time to cause your grandfather's death in the first place? It's a loop, a contradiction, a paradox. The idea of changing the past in such a way that it would prevent your own existence is an inherent inconsistency in the concept of time travel. You see the grandfather paradox isn't just a thought experiment. It's a challenge to our understanding of the universe and our place in it. It questions the very nature of time and existence, and poses a riddle that even the most brilliant minds struggle to untangle. Quite a conundrum isn't it? But let's delve deeper. The grandfather paradox presents a unique problem for the concept of time travel. It's a thought experiment that raises questions about the very nature of time and our place within its endless threads. Let's delve further into the heart of this paradox. It's all about causality, the relationship between cause and effect. If you were to travel back in time and prevent your grandfather from meeting your grandmother, you would never be born. But if you were never born, how could you have traveled back in time in the first place? It's a loop that seems to defy logic. The idea of multiple timelines or parallel universes provides one potential solution. In this scenario, by going back and changing the past, you create a new timeline separate from the one you originated from. So, the you that prevented your grandparents from meeting exists in this new timeline, while another version of you continues to exist in the original one. Another theory suggests that time could be self-correcting, that is any attempt to alter the past would be thwarted by the universe itself in an effort to maintain consistency. It's as if time has its own immune system, warding off any intrusions that threaten its integrity. Time travel and the grandfather paradox certainly give us plenty to ponder. The mysteries of the universe continue to captivate us, don't they?